Okay, let's start with him. Uh, what mode do you want to play on? Classic? Uh, let me see. Okay, uh... What modes, what modes are there? Uh, so Explorer is like the story-only mode, combat super oh. easy, Classic is like okay. normal, Tactician is hard, and then Honor mode is hard with Iron Man saves, so like permadeath and stuff. Let's go uh, with uh, Normal just because it's a nice balance between everything. Sounds good. Um, let's see. Alright, so I'll I join a game. I'll send you the information in a second, but I'm not 100% sure. Let me figure this out as we go. Okay. Um. Hmm. No, there's. I know there's a way to. Oh yes. Who can join your game? Invitation only. Uh, add you. Sweet. Um, yeah, so it gave you control of character two now. You should be able to customize Scarlet over there. Uh, we should definitely pick some complementary classes so we're not fighting uphill. What kind of character do you think you're going to build? Um, I think I'm going to build an Inquisitor. Inquisitor. Is he a better battle mage? All right, so either way, it's going to be kind of like a, a DPS CC heavy mage slash combatant. Uh, I will do a tank then. Um, which I've never built before in this game, so let's figure out what the starting classes are close to a tank. I guess probably a knight. Yeah, they get armor, bodybuilding, men at arms, constitution. Yeah, knight's the closest, but I'll do a little bit of customization on him. Uh, and I'll take leadership, so don't worry about grabbing leadership. Have I? There must be a way to spring this trap. Hold! Our enemies have lain a. Have All I right. bought anything that needs a good firing? Uh, I'm gonna be white as hell because that is accurate. There we go, light saffron, as white as they make them. With a full beard. Some of the hairstyles in this game are so ridiculous. Yeah. Uh, Sun Kiss Brown. With the star undies. Gotta have the stars. Okay. Um, that's probably gonna be the closest portrait we can get. Yeah, definitely. Alright, time to build. I'm not going to specialize in any weapons starting off, since you've already got some damage going for you. Okay. Plus, uh, I'm kind of a, a hybrid tank. I have healing. I gave myself healing, so I could kind of tank. Oh, uh, nice. Shit. So you can so basically give you more flexibility in what you want to choose. Sure. Uh, I'm definitely going to go mostly damage reduction, um, and then and then a little bit in leadership, like I said, just so we can get those party bonuses. I think I'm going to go with... Uh, 
A scientist, bonus point in blacksmithing and money crafting. Nice. And pet pal, so I can talk to the animals. Yes, I was definitely going to say one of us should take pet pal because that opens up some really cool, unique quests that you wouldn't be able to get otherwise. Uh, so I decided to do it. Um, let's see here. And then I don't really right. need speed for this build, so I'm going to dump that in constitution instead. And take one out of strength and put that in constitution as well. So just a big pool of life. One thing that I don't like is that they make you spend all your points out the gate. Like, at this point, I would honestly rather save one of my points and be able to get something to level 2 at my next level up than have to take, like, another level 1 ability. I agree with you there. Um, but I think... Shit, do I take Shield Specialist, I guess? Maybe? Either that or I could take one of the personality traits, like I could grab bartering if you think we're going to be doing a lot of buying and selling. Or... Well, some should always have barter so you can sell better. You start off with five, or start off, or one of the ones with you start off five reputation because it's a lot easier to get lower prices and whatnot. Yeah. All right, I'll take bartering then. I'll be our barterer. Uh, opportunist. Yeah, I think opportunist is probably important. But we'll see. What else could I grab? Thick skin is a good one, especially for the build that I'm doing. Yeah, I think I'll drop Water Rush and take Thick Skin. I dropped that immediately. <laughs> well, I mean, Water Rush is good for the kind of hero that I'm going to have because I'm going to be taking a lot of damage, but I think that I just generally want to take less damage in general. There we go. If I click accept, that locks in my stuff, right? Yeah, I think once you click accept, you're, you're pretty much done. Alright, I'm good with what I've got. Uh, I'm oh, sure. no, all your characters. Nope. I'll wait until you... <laughs> just in case. Yeah, like let that me just make sure that I have the uh, abilities that I want really quick and then we'll be good to go. So don't need melee power stance. Yeah, I tried that with a few builds and it just misses too much to be useful. Yeah, absolutely. I think I'm going to drop encourage. Uh, yeah, I'm going to drop encourage and pick up crushing fist so I can do a little bit more CC. Oh, you've got Crushing Fist. I'll change mine then, because I have Crushing Fist there, but I, I was thinking of changing it to something else. Yeah, I'll take Crushing Fist. I'll get up in their face. I have Battering Ram and Crushing Fist, and I'll, I'll CC, and you can focus more on, like, uh, I'll, uh, damage you I'll take cure wound. I'll take Cure Wounds, because I'll have Cure Wounds, Vampiric Touch, and Regeneration. Oh, nice. I also have Cure Wounds, so I can bail myself out if we get split up. Okay, good. Well, then I should probably take something other than Cure Wounds. Because I minor mainly so that she can stay alive for a while up in the front line, but I need more damage, so I'm going to have to... Uh... Sure, yeah, grab a damage ability or something like that. Um, what do I want? Five oh, it's a, it's a Battering Ram. Fuck it. Oh, I love Battering Ram. It's such a good trait. Empiric Touch, Regeneration, Battering Ram. Cool. I think we're good. All right. You ready? Yep. We've got Kabuki Lady here. I see that. Stunning. In the days of old, 
The sorcerers of Rivalong cured the sick and healed the wounded through the a great power Revlon. called Source. Or Revlon or whatever the fuck. But a terrible darkness invaded the land, and Source was forever tainted. I do like the sorcerers who once healed now only destroy, and madness has overtaken them. <laughs> a few brave Source hunters are all that stand between Rivalon. And the dark power that I'm just wondering how that lady in the picture that they show on the loading screen, how her uh, hand is so big shadow. compared to the, the bow she has. I mean, <laughs> Don't I mean look at that. The perspective just doesn't work. Her arm's short. It's like 90% forearm and then there's a huge fist. What is going on there? Rise and shine, Master Source Hunters. The cam wants you up on deck. Oh, damn, I should have made an archer. Means we're X, close capital to X, X, Legolas, X, capital X, there, X. <laughs> oh, I forgot to change my person's name. City's yeah, full of undead, hungry and out for right. blood. Like but you're supposed yeah, to investigate that murder, ain't you? They say it's Source that did the counselor in. Source in a city like Sicil, nowhere safe anymore. Here they are, Captain Sir. God's blessings on you, hunters. You'll be happy to hear we've reached Sicil. But there's trouble offshore, so we'll have to sail in carefully. Here, have a look. Those are orc ships, and they're blocking our passage. We'll get you as close to the city as we can, and drop you off on the beach. Be wary now. Orcs are on the attack. Undead have closed every route out, and there's a sorcerer on the loose. If we're to get justice for the counselor, have to keep your wits about you. Oh, I should pass the May the luck of the gods be with you both. Sword yeah. Hunters. That that might be a good idea. Alright, so Sweet. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out how to turn off the download notifications because it's not in the same area. Let's do this. Ooh, if I didn't so learn there were orc ships raiding to the west, I'd mistake this for a placid Shh. beach. At least the orcs make a bit of noise when they attack. Gonna be a bit of it's a dark dealing sorcerers that will strike with all neither warning nor mercy. Order grab all these shells because they pretty decent trade bait in the first town. I thought they're also for crafting. Uh, you can use them for crafting. You can also apply one uh, to yourself to apply wet. So like um, reduce your chance of being burned and uh, and or increase the effects of fire on you. Oh, it's a backpack over there. Mm -hmm, didn't it? Um. Is that a corpse? What's it doing here alone? Let's see. Cotton candy dye, some cheese, a love grenade, and. Oh, I remember that. That's uh, that's set loot. That's the same every time. The uh, painting in there is worth like 300 gold, which is nice. Whoa, this is terrible. I should take off these goggles. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they reduce your accuracy and stuff, but they greatly increase your luck. Look, it just makes everything look ugly. It's all wireframe. <laughs> uh, did you read his journal? That'll start a quest for us. Oh, I should. I never read. I just saw all the. <laughs> all the... Okay, there's some experiment. And that's it. Now we get dialogue for sets. <laughs> 
man jumped off a cliff at the behest of some statues, of all things. Um... Pure madness. How could someone be so utterly naive? Rivalon is no stranger to the supernatural. He <laughs> might well have flown into the sunset and looked down at us cynics laughing. <laughs> oh, you're romantic. No, I just like the idea of someone flinging themselves off. It is fantastic. That actually opens up a really cool quest line in the rest of the game, too. Oh, I should have probably read all this stuff when I've been playing it multiple times. I just usually ignore it. Oh, it's it's pretty neat. Uh, there are these statues that multiple people you run into talk to or talk about that all uh, lead them to Take do these the really crazy the rational temple. things. And you've got to start figuring out like where they are, why they're driving all these As people say, insane. Oh. Cool. Well, I can't wait to take, check that out. Arise, fair dead. Seize upon our enemies. Man, this fight on tactician mode absolutely fucked me up when I first played it. Gus, yeah, fuck it. Gus the Kabuki dude. <laughs> um, <laughs> nice. Hell yeah. Um, I don't have enough AP. Perfect. Man, that is much easier on Their classic mode. Said on something about escaping with a Those thieves were dungeon, I imagine. Can we get inside? What could they have been so keen on taking? Um... We can't well turn away from such an odious show of source. Let's investigate the tomb. Indeed, for all we know, these dark dealing thieves may be involved with Councillor Jake's murder. Nice. And your loot, just an old cloth cap. Uh, I don't think there's anything off to the left here, but I'm gonna go check first before we hit the, the tomb. Yeah, no, that's well, we can get to that area after the tomb. Not that XP is required, but it does get you some decent XP and some All right, starting loot. I think that this rat this seems this seems this seems to be broken well. um but only you can talk to him because you've got pet pal or whatever oh yeah i guess i can't talk to rats yep man that should work for the rnc <laughs> get back here rat i get <gasps> I'm bust this chest open um, are you using a sword for anything? There's a short sword here if you if you want it. It's not nearly as good as mine. So the rat says, Squeak, do you like shiny gems as much as those other fellows? I admit the king's stone was pretty, but hardly as tasty as a nice crumb of steel bread. Oh, well, whatever tickles your whisper. And that, that that's it. Oh, okay, uh, fair enough. Says. One of the rats in here, I, I've never taken Pet Pal, but I have heard, uh, just reading, that one of the rats, either in here or in the first city, gives you a quest, so they're probably worth chatting to. Well, I plan on talking with all the all the animals I can. Good, good. Ooh, rotten eggs. Delicious. If we come across the at some point too. I could definitely use one of those. Oh boy, rotten eggs. Mm-hmm. Delicious. Careful! There's a mine in the middle of our path. Someone must have an interest in protecting whatever's kept there. If you've got some sort of ranged spell, we could take that mine out. Otherwise, we have to tiptoe around it because I don't have any ranged weapons. I have one ranged spell, but it's vampiric. Whatchamacallit. Actually, yeah, I don't want to waste a grenade on it. We'll just walk around it. Just be careful. Uh, you 
should probably take these. Oh, I can just put stuff in your inventory. That's fine. You can't do that in DLC too. Hold on. Let me see if I can vampiric touch it. Oh, I'm getting away. Oh, uh, nope, I can't. It has to be a living. It has to be a living creature. Lame. Oh. Get back here, at. This seems to be broken. So this rat comes from a long line of cadaver eaters. Oh, good. Oh, lockpicks. Hell yeah. Um, I'll do my quick bars once we get into town. Not to mess with it right now. What did we get? I'm gonna send this to you. I'll just put a grenade in your inventory. I've always heard there's typically more to a king's tomb than meets the eye. Oh, there's another rat. It could be a myth, or it could be our lucky day. This is the same corpse-eating rat as last time. I'm gonna kill what about you, rat? Man. It's actually... I mean, you don't get a ton of experience, but it is kind of worth it to kill the rats after you talk to them, because they give you 90 experience apiece, which is almost as oh. much as like a super low-level enemy. I found it. Oh, I missed. That's embarrassing. Oh my god, what the hell. That's I killed it. Mad dies. <laughs> No, he's only half dead. <laughs> oh, there shit! Go. That's 90 Street. Where are the other rats? Fuck them. Yeah, it's free 90 for each of them. Definitely worth taking them out. God damn it. These rats are too slick for me. Seven, have mercy on your soul. Alright, gonna open this tomb and read this parchment. Tend the graves in the antechamber before moving into the inner rooms. To proceed, stand close to the impressed door and press the button that appears on its right-hand side. Here. This seems to be broken. Yeah, I don't think in uh, Divinity Original Sin 2 you're going to be able to put items in other players' inventories. Uh, I was watching another uh, report on the, the game Master Mode, and they were talking right. about they, they really want uh, in Original Sin 2 to have a much more traditional like RPG-type experience, including the ability to use like subterfuge against your own teammates and stuff. Um, so you can like slip them poison potions and stuff uh, in trades. Or put like impossibly heavy things in their uh, in their inventory to, to mess with them and stuff. But I'm assuming that they won't allow or they won't let forced inventory management happen for that reason ah. to prevent like abuse or whatever, you know. No, it makes sense. It makes sense for that. All oh, right, now I have a wand. Oh, nice. And the fireball spell from it. Fire. What's this? I found something. Under lock and key. Um, I do not have the key for this. Do you? you made short work of I have the key. key. But I don't imagine our weapons would survive such use for long. Oh, fire resistance potion. That's neat. Rain, scroll. So we can make it rain here. Cast skill here. And we'll leave these barrels away. Oh, it's just a water barrel. We don't need that. We do want to save the other rain scroll. We found one outside as well that I have. Uh, okay. There is an optional thing you can do in the first town. Um, orcs catch this ship on fire, and you can use your rain scroll to put it out, and you get some bonus dialogue and I think some XP and stuff, which is neat. Sweet. 
Did you chat with this rat already? Can I slaughter it? Or oh, no, I haven't. I just blew up the trap here. Oh, perfect. But I used the fireball, so that man set everything on fire, so whoops. Oh, oh well. It's fine. All right, rat. Where's this rat? Oh, there it is. Right over there in the corner. Wherever black robes tread, chaos fall. Damn. Get back here, rat. You need to die. Let's see. Key, lockpick, or hammer. Key. There's a key right next to it. Since I'm going to be up close most of the time, I'm going to really quickly send you all of my thrown weapons. Like grenades and stuff. I think that's about my main one. Oh, you probably have that scroll as well. You should probably grab this scroll too. Or here, I'll just I'll send it to you. I'm trying to kill this rat, but it keeps do it keep it dodges all my wand attacks. <laughs> They're sneaky, man. Oh, uh, another water barrel, real quick. There's a water barrel. Not enough strength to carry a water barrel. Are you sure? Yeah, I think it requires like nine. Um, shit. I don't want to use our other rain scroll, but I do think there's items off to the right if we can find a way to get water over there. Ah, oh, mug of water. Can I throw this? Let's see. Uh, Damn, this thing does dead still. Water to the spell is poison. Fairly sure. Ah! Uh, is it still evading you? You're getting juke by this rat. Yep. Yeah, there is a chest over there. Stock it, stock it, stock it, stock it, stock it. Wait for, wait for it, wait for it. Damn it! <laughs> One hit. Yeah! Finally! Oh, meat! Mmm. Rat meat. So yeah, if we can get water, uh, we can clear that poison this out seems over to be there. Broken. I have a rain scroll that I could use to get to Damn it. it. I should have picked, picked rain as my spell. Um, I do have a rain scroll, but I think we probably want to save that to be event. Yeah. Oh, I agree. Area. Is really all that worth it? Fire, flare scroll. All right. Nice. You should have a few of those. I threw some in your uh, inventory. I've spotted something. Nope. Put that there. And then put this here. And put that there. Voices downstairs. The last thing I need is to surprise another. This seems to be. This seems to be broken. All right, time to go light these bad boys on fire. I'm a rock. Throw. Oh, I can't throw that far yet. I sense enemies nearby. There we go. Get burned. So yeah, we'll probably just want to kite them. They actually will both die from burning damage if we just don't go too close, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'll just wait. I'll hang out up here to try to pull aggro if they come in. Save all my AP. Yeah, there goes one of them. The 
This other one made it out of the fire, but it should be easy to kill. Can you vampire question? He's a mummy. I don't think he has blood. No, I can. I just have to be closer. Uh, but I don't want to be closer, so I'm just gonna go here. No, yeah, just just hang back. I think I will probably kill him on this turn anyway. Meet your demise. Yep. Sweet. Uh, there's another fireball scroll over there. Should probably grab that. Where is? Where is? Oh, let me just. Oh, there it is. Yeah, hold Alt. And it'll show you where everything is. Ooh, another rat bro. Rat man. This seems to be broken. You are so observant. Uh, Roderick. Yes. No. Put this there. And this there. Because I have no respect for the dead. Oh, fuck you, rat. Nothing good? Nope. Alright, I'm gonna kill him. Maybe. Attack him. God damn it. <laughs> yes. Come on, one more. He's getting away. He's so elusive. No glory yep, that, that's the problem I found. Alright, got it. They wouldn't, they, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't stand still long enough for me to click attack. I need a damn shield, and then I can start using. Oh, uh, you should definitely take this ink potion. That's for do sure. Do you want a? Do you want a shield? I can just give you mine. Um, no, you can keep it for now. I'll get one when we get to the first town. We're not gonna run into any sort of like dangerous encounters before then. We'll get like a decent quality one from a merchant or something like that. I just have a, a handful of one-handed weapons, uh, and eventually I do want to switch to it. I'm not really focusing on DPS, so I think it would probably be a better, better fit. I need to get level up so I can learn bow and arrow. Go uh, stand on that pressure plate that's kind of behind you and to the right, so I can come through. Sure. And then this is the first real encounter. Uh, as soon as you step up here, it'll start. So I'm just gonna get right up on this place. No, hold up, hold back. Come, uh, I'm gonna blow me and she's a fireball. All right, I'm getting back. I'm getting back. I don't think I'll actually start taking damage. Last Strange time. indeed. I suppose you only crept among the in life. Run if you like. <laughs> Oops. Nope, can't do that. Gonna back off. Yeah, good plan. I'm actually gonna go for his adds first, because his archers can stun us pretty much indefinitely. Uh, and don't want that. So, let's see if we can just take care of that. He's burning, by the way. Yeah, yeah, so burning only applies if you start combat first, or if they move after the ground below them is on fire. Which is kind of weird, but, I don't know, divinity man. Alright, he's down, and then I will use 4 AP to knock him down. So I'll be able to take him out this turn, but then he will come back from the dead. Uh, Death never dies, fool. Death in a thousand out. forms rules all. Let's see. 
There you go. Thank you. Into take the, the healing sword. potions. I'll take the healing potions and this sword. Back on my feet again. And the stone gate key and the bracers are only as good as the ones we already have, so those don't really matter. I'm gonna equip this sword real fast. All right, cool. Yeah, this is significantly easier than tactician mode. I wiped a few times on the, the tactician mode fight there, too. Actually, I think every combat encounter so far I've had to reload at least once on. Ah! I've only played on normal because I don't really want... Well, my first playthrough is always on normal, then I go to hard, unless it's like a series I know really yeah. well. I'm just, I'm just a nice kiss, man. Um, Any corn on the beach. So there is a shovel over here, which we should definitely snag. And there's also a really funny, uh, very quick quest that we can knock out. Alright. Which, it'll be interesting to see how it plays out, because there's some conversation role-playing that we get to do. And I'm curious to see which direction we take it. <laughs> um, after this waypoint, so we can come back here later if we have to. And then we can go meet our buddy, Ish Michelle. She is over here. More shells. A comes my way, walking the sands upon which this poor shell must suffer. Who are you, Sir Shell? Call me Ishmael, son Ish of the sea, an outcast upon these wretched shores, an exiled shell doomed to live under a cloud. Are you talking to him? Yeah. Uh, so oh, I see the. I see the thing on it. Does it show you the dialogue? No. So he says, call me Ishmael, son of the sea, an outcast yep. upon these wretched shores, an exiled shell doomed to live under the canopy of an arid sky and not his native tender water. Uh, I say, of it seems strange that you can talk, and he says, of course I can talk, but I'm silly. Than There's more tongue to me than heart. Indeed, the surprise, Indeed, the surprise should, should be mine, for I still I remember still the days remember when the your days kind when swung from branches swung from and plucked branches, the vermin out of their neighbor's the fur. Uh, you say that you're doomed? He says, my fate is a cruel one, I assure you. How many snot noses have held me up against their dirty little ears only to claim they can hear the ocean? Uh, of course they hear her, the brats. We're on the very edge of the great aquatic mutter, for whose embrace I so desperately long for. Uh, I say, so it's the sea's embrace you long for? Yes, I, the king of pearls, ache to repose anew on his coral throne. Hurl me towards Hurl the water, me swim me as far as your arm's strength swing gives lease, and treasure long sunk I will grant thee. I think this is where we get to roleplay at now. Okay. Uh, Kindness is its own reward, and then there's the promise of- And pass up the opportunity of simply taking him and selling his valuable pearl. I think not. Let's see. <laughs> now very short-sighted. A pearl is worth a few coins, to be sure, but who knows what riches lie hidden beneath the waves. Who says he'll make good on his promise? This pearl is a sure thing. His words, however, are not. Now we get to play the ultimate game, Rock, Paper, Scissors. This is what I played the game for. For high-level Rock, Paper, Scissors. All right. Ah, oh, damn. I love this concept as like an argumentative <laughs> tool. It's like there's no real fair way without like actual dice to roll out persuasion, you know? So it's just yeah, exactly. Rock paper scissors it out. Although original sin two will support dice roll conversations, which is pretty rad. We're in each other's heads, David. <laughs> yep. Up. Oh. There we go. Ah, you guessed right. Ooh. 
This is tense. It's never this close with the computer. It's always very lopsided. I think they, they seed the RNG a little bit in uh, yeah. single player. Ah. Hmm. Oh, you win! Yes! Into the ocean with him. Boo! No, no, we'll do as I say and there's an end to it. Oh, you got the egotistical trick. Yes. So we chuck him, and then he gives us a chest. There's a ring that I think is actually better for you than for me, so I will give it to you uh, along with Hold your cash. Uh, no, actually, I am going to equip this ring because it's damage related or uh, damage reduction related all right cool that's the only other thing that we can do before heading towards town although i do wish there was a little bit more in this opening area just as like a reward for exploring around but the call me ishmael shell quest is, is pretty good so i won't complain too much Practice on you. That is good. Uh, I'm gonna give you one of these trap disarm kits because I already have one. Split. And set. Oh, this is a fun little conversation. I'll get right there, oh, Sam. they don't have their dog on no uh, normal mode. The tactician mode, they have a dog with them, too. I guess probably to make the encounter harder if oh. you do fight them. Hold it right there, orc scum. No one sits past the challenge. Yes. Does it look, look like one of them orcs to be? <laughs> Not a single orc. Just hold your tongue with you, baby. I've sworn to protect my Can't be too careful. Uh, we're here on Source Hunter your business. Your source hunters, are you? And how are we supposed to verify that? We can't read, my friend. So for all we know, those we can't papers read, say so you're a polymorphous paper say you're a polymorph bedroom parrot. bird cage. They don't prove a You know what? what an asshole. We'll take you two to the wizard. I know he reads. He has books large as a house, that one. Yeah. Hip Um Ooh. Do we want them to lead us or do we want to fight them and take some more experience off of them? I don't know. Uh, I've never fought him. Let's give him a fight. I don't need an escort, especially not a drunken one. Back and face me too. You two are a <laughs> I always fight them. <laughs> you defy the legion, will you? The punishment for that offense is death. Bring it on, ya chump. Oh. Such better initiative than I do. It's so weird. Oh. <laughs> I'm, tr I'm trying the bow and arrow, even though I'm not skilled with it at all. <laughs> uh, why is it? Okay, there we go. Oh, I do not have enough AP. Interesting. Um, Alright, then I will just move here and get in their face. Alright. There you go. Should be fine for if you turn. Now I have enough though. Uh, let's not. Could be a scam. We won't be hearing from you for a while. And put some damage into. Oh shit, this weapon takes so much to swing. As good as a new pen. Oh, how many turns does this heal for? Three turns. That's awesome. I thought it was just a one off heal. Nope. It's a uh, heal over time. Did I really? I just got XCOM, man. There's like 85% chance to hit. Oh, 
Oh, we did just level. I was gonna say, my health just jumped up significantly. We didn't. Oh, I didn't get my gun. That's <laughs> nice. Well, there we have it. Two dead legionnaires. They deserved it, the cretins. Right you are. I won't <laughs> shed tears for the likes of them. Glad we can agree. Uh, oh, and we get a free tomato out of it. Best loot in the game. <coughs> <coughs> we can make pizza with that later. Mushrooms, definitely take those. <coughs> Alrighty. Shells. Oh yeah, the orcs are up here. Yeah, yeah, they'll be the next big encounter that we take on. Um, I'm gonna send this grenade to you. I will... Another tomato. <coughs> um, you're using bows, right? I'll send that to you. Yeah. Cool. I'm using bows in one handed if necessary. I just want my character to have be adaptable. I think the bow that I sent you is uh, a little bit better than the one that you have, but there might be a level. Don't start the encounter yet. I'm gonna grab my skills and it is. up really quick. Oh. There we go. Uh, I'm not gonna spend this point yet because I don't have to. But I am gonna grab another point of constitution. We don't get a talent yet. All right, cool. You ready? Yeah. Sweet. Oh, interesting. This fight is significantly different on Tactician. Yeah, there are a lot of differences between the two modes. This is much less stressful. There's about twice as many enemies on. Oops! Did you just shoot the rock. Yep. <laughs> Oh boy, I'm very, it deserved it. very confident in having you in our party, dude. <laughs> My 39% chance uh, definitely was not successful. It was a really interesting skill that I took on my hunter in single player that I kind of regret on my ranger in single player. Uh, that makes you more accurate the farther away you are. So at max distance, you have a 100% chance to hit, and anything uh, closer than that, it actually goes down. And it's really good for kiting, but it's really bad against aggressive enemies, obviously. 100% chance on knockdown enemies. Love that. Oh, and flanked. Hell yeah. I like how he stood up to fall down. Yeah, absolutely. It's the only dignified way to do it, you know? This orc has class. He's not just gonna go out on the ground like some sort of chump. Let's flank him. I don't think I can. Oh, I can get one. Oh, sweet. My target dances in shadows. She says while he's standing in the open sunlight. <laughs> it's a metaphor. Orc does have some pretty good dodges. He's juking everybody. Thankfully, he's not interested in hurting us, though. He seems to just want to beat the shit out of all these legionaries, which I'm okay with. I don't, I don't blame him. They just kind of annoyingly. It's kind of terrible to say, but in my single-player play, uh, I... Yeah, I'll bring the AP and get close to him. Uh, I drug the fight out and let all the legionnaires die so I could leave them without having to kill them myself. Oh, I don't blame you for that. Let's see if I hit him. It. Nope. It. Oh, 
Nicely done. We're a bibius and genius. They hear the how very disquieting. Beer? Hell yeah. I don't think I ever found this corpse. Lane. I also just realized that I don't think either of us took perception, which means we're gonna have to really like scour areas for stuff. I thought about it, but I figured talking to animals was cooler. We can go get uh, a companion pretty early on um, that has like really high perception, so it's not a huge deal. I'm just waiting for the grave robin. Kitty time. Oh, you still have a point to spend. What? Yeah, I'm saving that point so I can get my uh, men at arms up to dozen tomcats fighting over the world's last mackerel. The the points go up linearly, so level one costs one, level two costs two, level three costs three, etc. Uh, so I wanna I wanna get two points so I can blow it on man at arms. Ah, but I see we've suffered another. Order. Are you lock picking? And There's judging some by the relative I do not have any lockpicking, neither of us do, but that same guy that we can get, uh, conclusion. pretty much as soon Source as we want hunters to. Have arrived um, he has a lockpick of three, I think, um, so he's definitely good to have in the party. Another orc landing, and judging by the relative ease with which it was dispatched, I can only come to one conclusion. Source hunters have arrived in Sizio. You're as welcome as a glass of cooled milk on a hot day, day cooled milk on a hot day. I'm, I'm Arvin, at your service. service. It was I it who was requested, I your, who presence requested your presence city. in this troubled city. So you were, so and I so you can't. weren't. Behold! There we are. Meet my other half, Hunter. Ah, oh, shit, it's a person! Ha <laughs> ha! No need to look so flabbergasted. The weapon that I just want to talk with some cows. Rife with tricks oh, did you? Style, but I yep. assure you, my plea is an earnest one. So, now that the cat is out of the bag, let us You're turn to the much. matter of um, Counselor Jake's murder. He basically murder. says, someone here has it's been hard murdered. It's to put my finger on it. I'm a wizard, but, but I can't Captain figure it out. Aureus, You're a source though, hunter. Please figure it out The local commander of the Legion insists Jake uh, was murdered in a downstairs room really of the King so Crab Inn the up in Sysio Prop. The Legion keeps it under lock and so there are. She sees still. Don't simply Yante. take my word for it, Hunter. It may be well worth your while to cross examine her yourself. A human, you say? Truly? But that. And yet, I don't quite know what to. Ah, the least some and we've as no but to be. But I'm one and. Uh, quick recap undead for anyone that we end up showing this recording to. Like he basically says there are undead me. terrorizing our town. Uh, and orcs coming from the beachfront. Oh, come over here. I'll show you the uh, the boat thing I was talking about. Oh, okay. Give me a second. Yeah, yeah. We need more help. She's Big old burning boat that you can throw a rain scroll on. And then all the people cheer for you, and you get 900 experience and a reputation. Send this arrow to you. And I will send this one over to you. Because it is not as good as mine. So, yeah, quick reputation when we get into town, which is nice for bartering. Save that shit before we. This waypoint really quick so we can port around. One thing that I haven't figured out yet uh, is out here on the dock there's a chest it's behind a rope and your character even makes a joke they're like ah oh, best heroes in Sysiel and they can't climb over a rope I have no clue how to get to the chest and it drives me crazy I thought you could cut it with scissors 
Uh, this is my theory. I never, uh, I have scissors. I'll try it. Yeah. Let's see what you can do. One thing that I can do that I never thought about, though, is I do have a teleportation scroll. I could always teleport the chest back over to us. Um, these guys over here give us a quest to find them a new job. I don't know how you did. I thought the all a home, a livelihood. Their ship all sinks. sunk in a map. Well, we were merchants. What seems like a moment ago, with our ship sunk, we're a little more than three men with nothing more to say than boo. These what? damn orcs, they can't keep off this place for the life of them. They came in here slinging stealing fire all the fish, and swinging stealing swords. Fish and Wasn't a thing we could do to defend yeah, ourselves. Yeah, we can uh, go cook the fish up. Uh, they turn into dinners, and they feel you pretty, pretty helpful. With our ship gone, nothing for it but to. Oh, get I was just stealing to steal. No, I know about predicting. Right I usually cook something early on, but let's see what's in the basket. All right, there is a cup of tea. Delicious. Madness. Thought we. I think, the yeah, there's a merchant out here. Ahoy, sailor! Are you enjoying the fresh winds of Sicil? This guy has some wands, if you're using wands. Um, that we can afford, especially with that painting that you have in your inventory. Alright, let me, uh, let me, are you over there if I am? Yeah, yeah. The painting's in your inventory now. Okay. Uh, what kind of wand do you want? I'll grab one for you then. They have a fire one uh, that has three fireball charge. They have a summon wolf one that has three summon wolf charge. And they have a water one that allows you to cast ice shard, which has a chance of freezing, but it does much lower damage. Um, hmm. I don't know. What else do they have? Uh, robes. Some decently armored robes uh, that increase movement and HP. Uh, they have a, a ring that increases resistance to fire, air, and water. Uh, an elvish fire staff. And then some pretty crappy armor that probably wouldn't benefit us. Uh, you know what? I'm almost out of... You know what? How about the fire staff? Sure. I'll take two-handed weapons, as well. Okay, uh, I have a two-handed that I can give you then. Well, I don't have two-handed yet, so... Oh, fair enough. I have a bunch of shit in my app. I don't remember if we need... Yeah, we should keep it real. We should not say that. Ever hear about the time the captain took the Duchess of Fedel's carriage for the joyride? No, it ain't. He drove it straight to the pub and back. Oh, is there a merchant there? I can sell some of the shit I have on me. Yeah, I'm, I'm over here talking to him right now. I'm picking up the, uh... You can actually barter with most of the people in the game. If you just click the little, uh... Like the, the, the bag to the left of the chat options. Shit, are you serious? It's not quite enough money? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Forgot about this. Speaking of youthful girl, that loopy legionnaire really thinks that orky charm loves him. I wouldn't let an old wig farm under yards of my loving nature. Ever hear about the sweet the captain took the Duchess of Fedel's for the joyride? Tell me about yourself. I don't care, actually. Just kidding. Uh, so I will send you all of the crafting-related stuff, because you said you took scientist, right? Yeah. Sweet. I'll send you all the crafting and cooking stuff. 
Uh, I will send you this sword. If you're taking two hands, I would definitely appreciate the shield that you have. Yeah, sure. My my um inventory is almost full. Uh, if you haven't started loading up your backpacks, you should start with one, and you found another one too. You can throw a bunch of stuff in there. Yeah. That helps. Oh yeah, I'm just putting all the crafting stuff in there. Yeah, that's usually what I do. Uh, oh yeah, and the wand. That thing that we... There we go. Now we need. He drove it straight to the pub and back. Sort of back to me. Is that uh, the... And don't forget the time he got caught. Yes, sir. 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 Ever hear about the time the captain took the Duchess of Fennel's carriage for the joy ride? Ha! Now it ain't. He drove it straight to the pub and back. Um, I'm working on my hot towers really quick. Passing a love now to the lizard councillor's wife. Is that why we never sailed the ship? Sailor, what news from the mainland? <laughs> oh, nothing. Leaking it. Zombies. That's getting to Legion. He really thinks it. that Orky Charm loves him. I wouldn't let it all within 500 yards of my loving nature. Psst. Ever hear about the time the captain took the Duchess of Fennel's carriage for the joy ride? No, he drove it straight to the pub and back. Uh, and don't forget the time he got caught passing a love note to the lizard council's wife. Oh, and then sort these. That's why we never sailed the Yusuf Gore anymore. <laughs> and this bar will have all my scrolls on it. Alrighty. Really that Orky charm loves him. I wouldn't let it all within 500 yards of my loving nature. All right, I sent you all the crafting stuff and two-handed stuff that I had, and the cooking stuff. Yep. I sent you what uh, I had Boop. for the uh, arrowheads. Yeah, those arrowheads are nice. Uh, I craft arrows all the time for my ranger. The special arrows in this game are super strong. Speaking of youthful gore, that loopy legionnaire really thinks that Orky Charm loves him. I wouldn't let it all within 500 yards of my loving nature. I'm so bad at sneaking. What do you want, cows? I if you're you. taking to the job. sea, leave a wide berth for Oh, they weren't that they weren't all that. One gives a fortune, the other one just says he's awesome. <laughs> I mean he's not wrong. Oh, before we leave the docks, you should try cutting this rope, and if it doesn't work, I'll teleport the chest over to us. Yeah, I it didn't work. Okay, let me teleport this really quick then. I just put on leather armor. Choose target to teleport and bring it here. Nicely done. Thank you. Open. Ooh. Um, damn. This is definitely worth the scroll. Uh, oh, that's one thing that we should definitely take. Uh, does your character have Lore Master? If not, I will spec. No, you, you can have. You can spec I'll take, into I'll it. I'll take Lore Master for sure. Um, because I just found unidentified items, so when we get a magnifying glass, I can start identifying those. Which is something we should probably do early on, because I have a feeling that both of these items are pretty good. Uh, it's a fire wand, which is neat. You get another wand option for you. And then there's also some plate mail, which will be good for me. Mm 
right, he says. Keep your pleasant... If it's conversation you're looking... As for myself, my... That idiot... Nah. Well, a source... I tell you... And, of course, have you talked to him? That fusspot said... What? <laughs> Oh, loose lips, McGee. So, oh, I just started a fight. You'd like to oh, shit. To I face. need to do this in my other play. Okay. To okay. To you. Or, yeah. No, <laughs> not a fight with us. I started a fight between two NPCs. Funny. Are you mad? We're guards, not drunks on the street. Enough. Both of you. What is this? Back to your post at once. I upset you. Sir, I'm sorry. This is an important matter. A uh, matter of honor. Such matters are to be settled oh. on your own time. Understood? Understood? Is this locked? Yeah, it is locked. Lame. Oh, darn. Oh, they won't let me steal stuff. Away from there, you pilferer. That good. But do not courteous is my name. The my guarding of this door. Is a glue when you've been naughty round here? Oh, shit. Oops. I pressed to open it. Oh, yeah. Uh, fight time. Yes, I want to flee combat. <laughs> flee! I suggest you flee. Yeah, I'll flee as well. Yeah, he's level six. We're not gonna. We're not gonna win that. I hope I can flee. My guy has really bad flee rolls because I haven't put any points in these decks. Failed to flee. Enemies are too close. Uh, excuse me, ladies and gents. I would like to step away. Sweet! Made it out. We're good. I was just clicking on shit. Jeez. I felt like I was trying to actually steal. Oh, yeah, I was. But anyway. I love stealing games like this. Um... So the beach out north, I think, is overleveled for us right now. Yeah. Are these guys still hostile to us? I don't know. I didn't go back in there and check, to be honest. Nope. They're not. Oh, that's good. Ah, uh, better to evacuate this place while there is. Better to evacuate while there's time left. What does that mean? Good luck with these Sicilians. General store. Oh. We can get in here later. It's the same place that we get that uh, compatriot app that I was talking about. Tight. And there's actually a ton of paintings in there, which is really good for us because those sell for between like three and seven hundred a piece, which means that we can get some nice. pretty swag gear. See, uh, no one's around. You wouldn't raise a fuss if I uh, borrowed one of these fish, would you? Bono, indeed. I'll sooner meet a cat wizard than see that merchant repaid. Come now, I'll be good for it, I swear! I never would have dreamt of resorting to petty theft during better times, but what choice have I got now? If it's steal or starve, I'll choose steal. Oh, my story's tired by now. I was a happy enough, a prosperous enough, before these lean times around Sicil began. Still, that doesn't waive a man's need to eat, you know. So what do you think? Should I snag a fish? Ah, oh, he's only negative 45. For vacation with us. <laughs> That's not bad at all. <sighs> I suppose you've got a point. A hungry righteous? Man, you know. I don't want to be righteous. I messed up. Should try to min max my way into egotistical though, that's better for my character. 
and probably compassionate too, but that's not fun from a role-playing perspective, so that probably won't happen. <laughs> oh, these sheep are so fat and cute! I'll talk with them, just give me a second, I'll get up there. Yeah, no rush. So, my water spell, my water healing over time spell does 25 healing over, or 75 healing over uh, three turns. That's really good. It's a fuck ton of healing for this level. Yeah, for sure. That goes up with int as well, right? Yeah, I have a nine in intelligence. Oh, nice. I think. No, no. That's one thing that I wasn't a Eight. huge fan of, is like how it doesn't let you drop your stats below five. Like I really wanted to min-max some of my characters, and uh, it's not super min-max for me. I will wait to start All the right. dialogue for later. Oh no, noble friend. Oh shit. Your upper uh oh, what happened? Desperate need of a good scrubbing. I, I didn't mean to. Can OBS. Oh, you attacked the fucking sheep, David? I meant I was trying to shear the sheep. David, don't hurt the sheep. Sheep are our friends too. I'm on but my level, way. It's level one. I'll just kill it. I'm on my way to help fuck the sheep up with you. I found something. Oh. This is fun. Ah, uh, they're all barnyard animals and they're low level. No, yeah, I'm not worried about the fight with the sheep at all. Uh, one of the, the graves nearby that we can dig in. This was actually a mistake. I meant to uh, shear the sheep, but it just gave me attack option instead. Yeah, I figured you'd probably chat with them. I think some of the animals in town have quests, but whatever. We, sh we should flee. <laughs> yeah, you want to? I'm down with that. You just got to back away. Uh, it doesn't let you flee when you're this close. Actually, when was the last autosave? We say right before the orc encounter. Oh, fuck that then. I think. Let me look. Uh, load. Oh, right after the orc encounter. As soon as we got into the Oh, yeah, fuck that. It's too far. Too far. All right. Oh, cool. It just takes you right here into town. Yeah, it'll put you back at the nearest uh, shrine thing or whatever. Waypoint. Slimy, reeking, rotting sea garbage. Oh! What's up? Well, I'm fucking stupid. What? So I did take the sheer by the a dialogue choice. Oh. Well, that was fucking stupid. Dumb. At least you got some experience with sheep. That's true. And it's always fun doing a little bit of killing. It is. It is. Is this the general store? Yeah, we'll be back there later. It's okay. closed. Yeah, the uh, place where we get that uh, thief companion, there's a, a hidden passageway down there with him, and you can follow that up into the general store, and that's where we get a shit ton of paintings to sell for a shit ton of money. What are you staring at? Who are you, Captain Jack? You got any work some for a trio of sailors? Lost their ship and want some work? Uh, Just send oh, Captain sweet. Jackson Rooster home, is conceited as all fuck. Ha! That's awesome. Oh, hello, love. Uh, I'm gonna run back to the docks really quick and talk to the sailors and wrap this quest up for us real fast. Alright. Where... I'm lost. Doc, 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 doc. Not the right dock. Yeah, it is. Uh, down here. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Yeah, like right here. Boop, 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 boop. Cluck, cluck, those dark robed nuts really ruffle my feathers. 
sneaking around here all hours of the night. That sounds uh, suspicious. A little sus. Have you found us a job yet? Yes. Well, I found so there's a captain you. offering booze and brass for a bit of crate loading? There you go. <laughs> I guess that's not the end of the quest. Evidently, there's something else that comes up afterwards. Either that or we got no experience for it, which would make me a little salty. Oh, they're bugging out. That's fantastic. <laughs> oh, the three sailors that I found work for were just like scooting along the ground inch by inch without moving at all. Like moving their legs or anything. Just, just wonder what their new job is where that comes in handy. Right? Looking for some sailors. Um... Oh, okay. I'm finding out some info here. Oh, yeah? Found out that an undertaker took someone's sheep, and that may be who that is in that one grave. Ooh, nice. I found it out from a from a cock that was just wandering around. Ah, always pay attention to the cock. God damn it, which well is it? I want to find the shortcut underground so we can get that guy and also well, steal all those paintings. So the sheep don't like me anymore. <laughs> All of them? Do they just collectively hate you now? Yeah. That's fantastic. Yeah, the, so the same with the cows. But the chickens are, are cool with me. Friends to the cocks. Have we activated this waypoint yet? I don't think so. I don't believe we have. Nope. Sweet. A little bit of experience. I'll oh, be careful digging. There's uh, definitely some very high level encounters in some of those graves. No, I just blew up. Oh, perfect. Uh, I will come resurrect you. That was... I always... Is it this one that's always the one that blows up? No, wait, there's a different one that blows up. Uh, the one by the sheep that you slaughtered also blows up. If that's not the one yes. that you dug out. No, it's the one I dug out, the one by the sheep. Oh, yeah. There is another one that blows up. Um, so we should yeah. save before we start grave digging next time. Yeah, I completely forgot. I'm almost to you. I'm gonna bring you back. I'm right by the sheep. Yeah, I see you. But yeah, the barnyard animals don't like me anymore, so that's a mistake. Oh, hide your hands, Yeah, this grave always blows up. It's, it's a trap, as Admiral Akbar would say. One of these wells is actually secretly a portal underground, which saves us quite a bit of time in getting that companion. But I can't remember which well it is. Right up. Oh, I also have a key. Have some pity. Um, you can hold on to that. Uh, with magic pockets, it will automatically teleport the key to me if I find the door that requires it, which is nice. A log entry. What'd you find? Oh, Headless Nick. I love that guy. What's 
I'm gonna save really quick because I might get us in some serious trouble. If only the popular girls from the Source Academy could see how edgy and dangerous you've become. Quiet! Note! I'll thank you to take a step in another direction. The Legion's treasure room, I want in there so badly. But I am not stealthy enough. Save all the plot stuff for when we're together so we can trigger role playing. Well, she could do any real damage. Sorry, any sir. Real damage? Are you joking? I've been mauled. I'll be disfigured for life. Ah, uh, come on with the dramatics. It's not as bad as all that. The face, Furious. She bit me in the face. What's going on in this house? Someone just yelled blasted poultry. I see that. Um, I'm actually kind of confused. I don't remember where we get underground at, but I really want to go down there and get all those sweet paintings so we can have lots of money. Okay. Well, let's find this place. There is a well we can take down there, but there's another way to get down there, and I don't remember what that way is. So I will steal these people's fish instead, and put them in your inventory. You are the best pack mule I've ever had. <laughs> hey, hold on. Get, just hold on a second. Yeah, yeah. Get over here. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Uh, this is the other grave, by the way, that goes up to the right here that you're next to. So be careful. Me. Oh, how as good as a new rascal my last time. I nope. sank the seas. Oh, pray. I am but an age. You would hot spite. Um. I wish you could do something with this tent. It looks so cool. But what do you can do with it? the mortuary? Yeah, that's a, a plot thing. We should definitely do that together later. I think the underground entrance is up. No, this is where the forge is. Uh, so this is where we can cook if we want to cook stuff up before we go exploring. Yeah. Um, there's also blacksmithing equipment up here if we need to repair anything, but I think most of our equipment should be alright for now. Yeah, 50 out of 50, 68 out of 70, my underwear is still in perfect condition. Uh, but yeah, the forge up in the corner over there, if you do want to cook anything, uh, that's where. Okay. That's where the magic happens. Wait, right here, the place where the there's that stupid, whatchamacallit? What? No, don't, don't use the fire down there, because uh, it'll waste our cooking pot. We should save our cooking pot. Uh, the forge up here in the far corner, this big old stone fireplace. Uh, if you click on that, maybe I'll let you cook there. And once we get a mortar and pestle, we can start making bread and stuff. For now, we can just cook up the fish that we have. While you do that, I'm gonna go wander around and look for this underground entrance some more. Is 
the basement of the building? Maybe that's what I'm missing. Oh shit, uh, this is someone's house. Time to steal their stuff, I guess. Butter knife. I'm gonna use the butter knife for the rest of the game. Nice. Spread them all over. What's this do? Is this just like a rug? I can't click on anything for some reason. What the hell? There we go. Dinner. Good job. Potatoes. Oh, this is pot stuff. We don't want to do that right now. Graveyard, where are you? You're over by the graveyard, right? Uh, kinda, yeah. That's how we get underground, I recall now. One of the graves in there. Um, opens up a passage underground. Who's texting me? Did your present come today? Oh, um, shit. That's right. My mom sent me a shirt, and it arrived today, and I forgot to tell her thank you. Wait, I don't think I'm near the graveyard. <laughs> That's okay. I will track it down. I It doesn't put a marker on your map for some reason, which is kind of silly. I really think that's like a unique location that it would remember for you. But it's not. All right, I'm going to take a quick, I'm going to step out because I have to take a piss. Yeah, no problem. All right. You figure out where the graveyard is. Yeah, I'll, I'll get there and hang tight for you. Look out there, Hunter. Evil lurks beyond Psy Seal's ramparts. Graveyard. Uh, I'm going to stop this video then, and this can be our first little episode. And then uh, episode two, we will head underground and uh, get our new first companion and lots and lots of money.